Good morning, everybody. How are you guys doing? Welcome back to another episode here on the Glitchcraft SMP. Now, oh, I already spoil it. Wait. Um, all right, we're gonna stay over here now for a little bit. So, for this video to start off, um, first of all, I want to say thank you guys so much for supporting the last video. Uh, yes, I'm back now. I'm back, back in business. Um, although, um. We'll see how how do it will uh, how how do I will you know keep doing. Uh, either way, <clears throat> so for the first part of this episode, you don't watch a time lapse of me building a new villager beater. And by new, I mean you. You have, you have probably haven't seen the old one either from me. So uh, once you've seen this uh, time lapse, there we'll uh, take a look at the old one and the new one. And uh, yeah, let's do it. Roll the time lapse. And now when that is done, let's uh, check out what's going on over here. So if you are unaware, we have a new member on the server. His name is Building Pilot. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, Building Pilot. Well, I like your palette, my friend. <laughs> dirt and 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 dirt. Yeah, that goes well together. Really nice. Um, we got Jet. No, we don't got jets. We got jet CX. If you're unaware who that is, well, let me pull up a clip on the screen right now of of one of his videos. It's a pretty cool dude. This is Jet CX, and today I'm gonna be showing you how to make a very simple villager breeder. So what you will need are nine cobblestone walls, 32 stained glass or of any glass, um, 20 of any block. And I like to make it go with the glass because it it just looks better. Um, six doors, um, some villagers. Um, you could do, you can have two to eight villagers. So yeah, guys, we got the one and only Jet CX on our server, and I'm super happy to have him on the server. Uh, it's gonna be super exciting to play with him. Hopefully, uh, be able to do some collabs with him. Uh, and if you haven't missed his first episode, I'm actually in it. Although poor guy had a bit of issues with his, uh, well, we all know, we all, we YouTubers should all know what, you know, how amazing OBS and rendering and all that can be. So yeah, uh, let's see if we cannot spoil what's behind. 
um, because there is something further out, and you did get a glimpse of it just uh, a while ago. So here we go. Here's the breeder. Yeah, boy, yeah. Um, now, uh, I'm not sure if these two there, when they're bunched together like that, if that's the main issue or big issue. When they're like this, it's fine, it's fine. But this thing has been cranking babies left and right. And I'm not unsure of how many there actually are in there. I think it could be only two. But that's because they haven't been in this area. Neither me or Bolt has been in this area. Bolt is AFK up in the mob farm right there. But uh, what's going to happen now is I'm going to show you another time lapse. Now, my apologies, guys, because that, this is something I'm going to have to edit for a while. And um, I have about three, almost about four hours of footage to edit down to like two minutes of time lapse. So, yeah, I got a lot of editing to do. Um, and uh, yeah, I will see you guys very soon. I'm, um, yeah, wish me good luck. <laughs>so it's been a couple of hours now and um, I'm here to show you a little bit of progress here we have the two and the third one is coming over there there we go you can see we're on the second layer now oh poor guy they took damage and here's the third one 
and on the head one down so yeah we're on the second layer now now here's what I'm gonna be showing you guys in a little bit here there we go uh, pretty important that I get these blocks because I don't have any re my even there we go I don't have any reserve blocks on me so or spare blocks so if I lose them I lose them uh, <clears throat> so this one is almost done now as you can see here uh, what I've been doing is that because those uh, all these are too close for that breeder I mean that one could work but I don't want to take the risk so therefore I decided that I take as many villagers as I can over to these outer farms over here and down there you can see the action uh, I decided to put some um, walls there so that the iron lawns can't uh, go into the system because I want to see how many I gather up throughout the time of, of doing this um, and I've been at this for maybe an hour maybe an hour and a half I think something like that um, so I've got that done, I've got that done, the bottom is done, now I'm working on this one, and then we have the two top, um, and I'm unsure if I'm gonna have enough villagers to cover those two, uh, probably that one, I don't know about that one though, like, we'll see, we'll see, um, but there, that is, you know, it's good that I can empty out that breeder over there as much as possible, because then, I can focus a little bit more on that breeder and get that thing set up and a plus is that they are still breeding in that thing over there so you know as they move on there's gonna be more villagers in there which is always nice that's always nice to see so um, yeah let's uh, take a look and see how many there are over here now um, there's a uh, there's quite a few <laughs> uh, so how many are do we have over here then we got one, two, three, four, five, six over there. And we got seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh man, six on each side. So twelve dollars so far just gathered up here. Uh, and that is from having free farms activated, which I feel like is pretty good actually. Now it has been running a little bit. I think is it around 20 ingots in here already? Or is it, was it? Few, yeah, or 32 already in here. So like, it's you know, once I had two of them working, I uh, then blocked it off. So like, this has still been running a little bit, and I mean, oh, I can't wait until like this entire thing is done. It's gonna be amazing. But um, I am. I think I'm gonna end the episode here. Um, got lots of work to do off camera, so I'm gonna just end the episode here. Um. So yeah, by the time by the next episode, this thing should be done. And I I know I said in the last episode that I wanted to work on the house, but like I I, I don't want to do it now. I rather want to get this massive thing completed and then work a little bit more on my base. So yeah, but that's trying to do it for this episode. Hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, make sure to leave a like and comment. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe. I want to say thank you for 260 subscribers. Very appreciated. But that's been it for this episode. Have a wonderful day, and I will see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.